Hello, it's Cherie, and I'm posting another video, a little follow-up, and then also I've got a piece from my closet that um, I've had trouble styling in the past, so, but I know my first video, it was my very first, so I apologize. I wasn't real good at describing Stitch Fix and all that stuff, but I wanted to follow up, and um, I have on the jumpsuit from the other day. I tried this on yesterday and I mean this was if this didn't work for me then that kind of would have changed my whole purchase because uh, with Stitch Fix if you get all five items you get a 25% discount so had this not worked I probably would have talked myself out of the jeans and maybe the blouse and you know uh, probably the sweater I might have just gotten one item so but Luckily, the jumpsuit worked. I love this material. It is just so soft. So soft, in fact, that my tie keeps coming undone. I could probably double knot it later. But um, I do have just a regular bra on for a little more support for all my running around today. But um, it doesn't really bother me, the extra strap. So I don't think it takes too much away from the spaghetti strap. But I did tighten these up. They are adjustable. And I tightened these up and it helped with the length. And I've got, you know, some kind of platform uh, cork sandals that are cute with it. Even though they're brown, I think they still look cute. But I did come up with a solution so I could wear my flats and make it more practical for my day to day. So I wanted to share that with you. And I tied up the bottoms. So I did just a little uh, like t shirt knot in the bottom of both the pants so I can wear them with my flats. So, once I did that and I figured out that I could wear my little flat sandals with them all the time, I was sold. So, I wanted to go over the pricing. So, and I've got all the items here. I've got the uh, Fun to Fun Walden Split Neck Blouse, which I tried on last time. And the material, it's, it's a little itchy, you know, but it does give good dimension to the uh, the fabric there which I like and it's not not too itchy so and I don't have any blouses like that that fit me I think I donated or got rid of the other ones that I had that were similar in style so definitely I'm gonna keep that and it goes so well with oh and by the way that one is $38 so um, yeah $38 not too bad a price for a blouse and of course, I get my 25% discount. Um, this was a Market and Spruce Halls Brush Knit Two Pocket Cardigan, which I love. I wore this yesterday. I got a little busy yesterday and I didn't get to film this. And I didn't wear my jumpsuit, so there you go. This one's 44 Again, I get my discount. This was the Market and Spruce Karina Brush Dolman shirt. And this was 38 so I'm probably going to wear this Friday. I think I'll have to check the weather again. I think it's going to be a little cooler Friday. So I can wear that. And then the Studio Blue, which I love these jeans. You know, I've been wearing a lot of high rises lately. And so I got away from wearing just the normal mid-rise kind of jeans. And I forgot how much I love these. And they look really good with them. Um, tanks t-shirt I mean I wore it with a tank and with my um my cardigan yesterday and it was so cute and I almost wore them today I tried them on with a bodysuit which is like usually extreme summer you know like a tank kind of um bodysuit and I almost wore that today because I thought well I'll just have to wear my cardigan again you know but uh I wore my jumpsuit instead so which I'm really enjoying I love it but um, these were the most expensive thing. They were 64. They fit really well. And, you know, I've never tried Stitch Fixes brands before. And um, I really, really like them. And I didn't have any washes that were this kind of medium wash. So I'm really enjoying that. But so overall, the total would have been 242, but I got a $60.50 discount. So, um, you know, 
plus the, the $20. Now, I did uh, buy some tights for $15, so that kind of made my uh, my price jump a little, little bit. So with the tights, it was $196.50 minus the $20 with my styling fee. The total is $176.50. I had to pay a little tax and stuff, but, you know, it's a little expensive, but, you know, I'm trying to get a way from shopping so much in between times maybe just wait for these boxes to come in and uh, I mean I think they did really well my stylist was Jamie and really appreciate what the stylist did for me so and when I went to check out they said that um, I could get a quick turnaround box and they'd waive the styling fee so like yeah <laughs> <laughs> so I'll get another box next week, which is dangerous for me because I'm probably going to like everything in it, but I'll probably do another video with that. So anyway, my boys want to be around for the second part of my my video today. That's kind of it for the Stitch Fix, other than I'm going to get the tights out and show you um, the piece that's been troubling me in my wardrobe. It's a purchase I made a while back. It, it was on sale, of course. And uh, I've just had trouble finding anything that looks right with it. And it's a weird thing anyway. So anyway, stay tuned. I will be back a little later with that. So thank you. So Hello. I'm back. Got the boys. <laughs> <laughs> so they had a pretty good day at school. Had some tests. Had a math test today. Yep. <laughs> but I've got to go get my tights together and I'm probably going to put on what I had planned for the tights with this um, these shorts. Will somebody grab me those green shorts over there? The velvet ones. This is the weird piece I was talking about earlier. So they're free people and I got these. I think. Yeah, these are a medium. I might have done well with the small but I was afraid they might be a little too short. But they're that paper bag waist. And they've got pockets. You know how much I love pockets. And then just like that on the back. But they're such a pretty color. And I want something fun to wear with them. I brought a couple belts up. But, uh, you know, with the cooler temperatures, I got them in the fall. And so um, that's why I bought the tights. I figured I could wear those under that with some little boots. And um, I'm going to try on what I had intended for it. But then also what I got in my Stitch Fix box this week. Um, the blouse and um, the cardigan. They're different greens, but somehow it works. And maybe, you know, I might look like a leprechaun or like I'm, I could wear it on St. Patrick's Day. You never know. That's coming up. So uh, anyway, I'm going to try this on and I will be back. Bye. Okay, I'm back. So I put the tights on. They're just regular opaque tights, which uh, I'm not a huge fan of, but in cooler weather, you got to do it. I remember the days when I had to wear pantyhose to work every day, and I'm so glad those days are over. But um, in the wintertime, occasionally, a gal might have to, uh, especially if I wear a dress, which I'm not working right now, so... But I wanted to showcase the shorts. See, my problem with these is this paper bag waist. I mean, whatever I wear with it, I have to tuck it in. So um, again, I got these on clearance. And um, so you can see they're really a pretty velvet. I don't know if the lighting in here is great, but I love the pockets. They're very comfortable, but I mean, you just, what do you wear with them? Anyway, I have a belt. I think that this tends to break up the waist a little bit when I wear this. And I might get my little helper. Well, I gotta grab a jacket over there in a minute. Would you grab the black jacket for me? I've got my, my stage hand. You know, the, uh, the black jacket on the bottom of that. There's the back. So I think it looks a little better with the belt. And I found these booties. 
I must have got them on clearance or something last year. They were in my closet. I didn't even know I had them. I had another pair of boots in mine, but these are Dr. Scholl's and they're really comfortable. So, uh, that one. Let me grab this. And I got this jacket from Macy's on like a clearance rack. It's a Calvin Klein, but it was on sale for I think like 12 or $15. And again, I haven't really had an occasion to wear it, but I thought it was kind of cute with this. And these shorts, they are a little, I mean, they do come way above my knee, but I'm a short person, so sometimes I can get away with wearing some shorter things. But this was, when I bought the tights, this is what I had in mind in the cooler weather. But again, I really haven't had an occasion to go anywhere. But this is outfit one with the weird velvet shorts that I love. But I mean, you can see my problem. A warm with a t shirt. I might even try one on just to show you. But I mean, you can't wear it tucked out at all or even half tucked because this pushes anything that you wear over it out. And so your waist just disappears. But anyway, this is this. And uh, let me, I'm gonna try on the greens from the Stitch Fix yesterday. So I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. This is from my Stitch Fix. This is the um, fun, was it fun to fun blouse that I bought. And I kinda wanted to demonstrate my problem because with that paper bag waist, it's just, even if I were to tuck it in a little bit, it still, you know, doesn't look quite right to me. I don't know. And excuse my blindingly white legs. It's been winter time. I haven't been out in the sun in a while. But here it is. I tuck this one in. And again, I've got a, a brown belt <clears throat> that's like my black one. I got these off of Amazon. I think they were like $3 or something crazy. I think it's kind of, what, like a Gucci knockoff or something. But they're real leather, so and I'm not a big belt person, but, you know, when you come across something like this, I need one. So, anyway, I'll probably pull that out a little bit. I don't know if that makes it too short in the back. It's just weird. But this is this. I've got some little Steve Madden boots. I've had these booties forever, for maybe like five years. But they're like that olive green color as um, my cardigan from yesterday. They kind of match that. So it's a lot of different greens, but I kind of thought maybe on a day for shorts, you know, definitely spring or maybe even fall, I might be able to wear this together. So, and maybe a different kind of shoe. This is just what I paired it with, but I could go with something like that. But anyway, just wanted to, to share that, but you know, getting this yesterday kind of gave me a different option of something that I might possibly wear this with. You know, um, I was commenting on how soft the sweater was, and that's just a big factor when I'm buying clothes. So I think that's, you know, I was like, velvet shorts, yes, but it's sometimes it's a no. You know, more problems with the waist and all that. But, that was my my problem piece for this video. And um, anyway, thank you for letting me share that. I don't know if you enjoyed that at all, or but I did. It was fun for me. And uh, my my stagehand stagehand left right. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> but thank you for watching, and I'll be back again soon. I've got a stitch fix coming next week, next Thursday, I think. So a week from this Thursday on the 11th. And then um, I might come up with something in the meantime. You never know. Maybe another. I do have another uh, three people purchase. It's a, a pair of jeans that I haven't been able to match anything with. So I'm working on that. So maybe um, I'll try to get your opinion on that. So thanks for watching. And I'll see you real soon. Bye.